All right, so Thursday, stretching out that upper body, that upper back, opening that chest, getting ourselves sitting up nice and tall. So start off by rubbing the length of those legs, getting the blood flowing all the way down those muscles, all the way up, all the way down, all the way up, using those thumbs down the inside of the leg, using those fingers down the outside of the leg. Going on to those kneecaps, rubbing those kneecaps, pushing the thumb down the inside of the kneecap and pushing it over to the outside of the leg. And then rubbing the outside of the kneecap and then just putting those hands on the top and rubbing those kneecaps around. Just get a bit of blood flow, a bit of movement. I'm gonna bring those hands up and then run those hands all the way down. So for the knees, hold onto your feet. Hold on to the base of the feet, pull that body forward, push that head high over those toes, breathing in, breathing out, push those knees down towards the floor, lift yourself up to vertical, put that left hand on the right knee, right hand behind, lift and turn, so it'll be a little bit stiff first because we haven't done very much, and then put the right hand on the left knee, left hand behind, lift and turn the other way, so don't force it, just feel it, just help yourself into that stretch. And then come back round to the front. Slide those hands all the way down towards those toes. Put those fingers on the toes. I've got my little finger on my index finger on the big toe. Push the toes away. Push the second toe away. Push the third toe. Push the fourth. Push the baby toe. Hold on to those toes. Put your hands over your feet. Put the ball of your hand against your toes. Pull those toes down towards the ankle. Really stretch the underneath of those toes. Take those hands away, let those feet relax, make the feet be vertical. Take them left, take them right. Take them left, take them right. Circles one way. Get those ankles really moving. Circles the other way. Really get those ankles moving. Feel all those crisps and groans and creases. Point the toes away. All the toes towards and relax the feet. Let those hands run all the way up the legs, sitting yourself upright. Pop the hands on the floor behind. Roll those shoulders up to the ears, down and back, and push those hands into the floor. Bring your chin all the way up to the sky and really jut your chin up. So you really stretch through that neck. And then bring that chin all the way down into that chest. And then push the top of the head away from the top of the shoulders and stretch the neck the other way. And bring that head all the way up to vertical. And tilt that head to the right, pushing the left ear from the left shoulder. Really push that shoulder down and <clears throat> push that ear up high. And then bring that head back up to vertical <clears throat> and tilt that head over the other way so your eyes are still looking in front. Lift that right ear away from that right shoulder. Push that right shoulder down. Push that right ear up. And then bring the eyes up to vertical. And then turn the head to the left. Lifting that chest, lift, taking that chin all the way over that left shoulder. Lifting that chest up high, squeezing those tummy muscles, holding yourself tall, pull those shoulder blades back. And then bring that head back round to the front and turn it all the way around the other way. Taking it, the chin all the way over that right shoulder, pushing, stretching through that neck. And then bring those eyes back round to the front. Squeeze those shoulder blades together, push that chest forward, push the tummy forward. Use those feet and pull your body forward onto your front bottom. And then take the hands off the floor, resting on that middle bottom, breathing in. And on the out breath, release those arms and let yourself roll all the way forward towards those feet, stretching, lengthening, putting those hands around the soles of the feet, push the feet away, <clears throat> feel the stretch through the armpits, feel the stretch through the upper back, middle back, through that lower back, and push those knees harder to the floor and feel the stretch in those hamstrings. Release those hands, sit yourself up nice and tall, and then bring that roller in. Bring in that roller. <clears throat> Pop that roller across the mat. Bend your knees up, have your feet flat on the floor. Breathing in. 
on the out press, lower the body down so the bottom ribs, bottom ribs, keep the roller down by your, just above your waist, your bottom ribs. Breathing in, take hold of the head, breathing out. Release the body all the way over the roller. Breathing in at the bottom and then breathing out, let that back go. Let the tension go. Breathing in again at the bottom. Breathing out. And then take hold of the head and bring it back up. <laughs> Move the roller a few centimeters up, breathe in. Breathing out. Release and do three breaths like before, breathe in. Breathing out. Breathe in. Breathing out. Push the tailbone down. Release that spine. Take the head in the hands. Bring it all the way back up. Move the roller a few more centimeters. Breathing in. Breathing out. Push the breastbone up. Push the tailbone down. Breathe in at the bottom. Breathing out. Rest that head back. Breathing in. Breathing out. Bring that head up, move that roller one more time. Breathing in. Breathing out. Breathing in. Breathing out. Breathing in. Breathing out, take that head in the hands, lift the bum up a bit and roll that roller down towards those bottom ribs, slowly keeping that head low, keeping that bum low. And then slowly back up towards the base of the neck. Keeping the flow of air through the lungs, long, slow, deep breaths. All the way down, all the way back up. And then leaning on that left side, all the way down. <clears throat> and then all the way back up. And then going all the way over onto the left. Onto the left. All the way over. All the way onto that left hand side, keeping that roller moving. You can drop your bum on the floor if you want in places. You can use your hand, you can use your other legs, use your feet. Rolling all the way through, slowly through those um, delicate lower ribs and then rocking that body forwards and back. So the roller's at the bottom on my floating ribs. I'm just rocking forwards and back. I've got my bum on the floor and then I'm moving. Lift the bum up and move that roller up towards that armpit. Going through those knots, letting that arm just drag on the floor as the roller moves down, body moves down, the roller moves up, getting into that armpit and then rolling all the way back up. Rolling all the way back up. All the way through. Down to those bottom ribs. And then down, start to go down again. And as you go down, turning over on towards the back. And then back up, supporting the head. Letting the head lean back. Keep that bum low. All the way down. All the way back up. Going over onto that back. Opening that chest. And then keeping going over onto that right hand side. All the way down. Up. 
And then keeping going all the way on to the right. Through those bottom ribs, so just slowly going through that armpit. Get all the way down to those floating ribs, to those bottom ribs. <clears throat> and then put as much weight on them as you feel comfortable. We're rocking forwards and back. Rocking forwards and back. And you might feel a bit of referred um, pain around on the other side, but that's because this, the ribs are a circle. They go around your body. Good, keeping that rocking all the way down. Going into that armpit and then moving all the way back up, slowly moving up, keeping that flow of air, keeping breathing, and then leaning over onto the back of it. Um, all the way back up and then down. And then back onto your back, taking hold of that head, resting that head on the floor with that uh, roller in that middle back, moving that, moving that roller, moving it in that middle back area, then lengthening that head away from the tailbone. So you can bump your bum on the floor and you can just rock it up and down, letting that head slide. And then getting it down to the bottom ribs, stretching through that belly. And then moving that full length all the way down, all the way up, leaning on the left. And then leaning on the right. And then putting that bum on the floor, taking those hands overhead, palms together, slide those hands away. Reach those palms together, try and make sure those hands are even, straighten those legs out. Push those hands away from the fingers. Lift that bum up a bit if you can. See if you can use your heels to juggle the roller and rock it a bit. So we're not just sitting in the same place. Lower the bum to the floor. Bring those feet back in. Bring those hands back in. Lift that head, move that roller down and up. Just move it over that area that you've just been sitting on. And then when you feel comfortable, bring that chin up and bring yourself up to sitting. So to carefully come up, spend a bit of time down there, put those legs out straight. Breathing in, put the arms out on the, on the legs and roll those arms slowly down towards those feet. Let that head push forward over those toes. <laughs> Don't bend the neck and have the chin right into the chest. Lengthen that body. Pull yourself forward, feel the stretch in those hamstrings. Lift yourself up nice and tall. Roll those shoulders up to the ears, round and back. Roll those shoulders up to the ears, round and back. Slide that roller out of the way. <clears throat> Pop those hands on the floor. Pull those elbows together. Lift that chest up. Take the chin all the way up to the sky. Jut the chin up. Stretch that neck. Stretch that throat, bring that chin, bring that chin all the way down to, to the chest. Push the top of the head down towards the toes. Stretch the back of the neck, pull those shoulder blades together. Breathing in, breathing out. Lift that chin all the way up to the sky. Jut it up and really stretch the throat. And then release and bring those eyes to horizontal. Turn the head to the right, uh, you look over the right shoulder. Push that nose over that shoulder. Bring that head around and turn it so you look over that left shoulder. Push that nose so it goes over that left shoulder. Bring those eyes back to the middle. Push off those hands, bring them up in front. Breathing in on the out breath, lowering down to the floor. One vertebra at a time, all the way down to the ground. Pushing those feet away, resting the head on the floor. Bring those arms all the way up. Bring them all the way over. Push those hands away. Pull those shoulders down towards the waist. 
push those hands away, reach those shoulders up, feeling them, get, trying to get them up to your ears, pull those shoulders away from the ears, down to the waist, bring those arms up to the sky, bring those arms out wide, squeeze those shoulder blades together behind your back, push the back of the head in the floor, lift those shoulders and chest up, release the shoulders on the floor, bring those arms up into the sky, then print that spine into the ground, let the legs just lift. Release those arms out wide, back to the hands to the floor. Squeeze those shoulder blades together, push the back of the head in the floor. Let those shoulders lift, let the spine lift, draw in the core. Release the head, let that, those shoulders come to the ground. Bring those arms up to the sky, push that spine into the floor. Breathing in, breathing out, release those arms out wide to the ground. Push them away from each other, squeeze those shoulder blades together. Push the back of the head in the floor, lift the spine away from the ground, the shoulders away. Feel the back of the neck engage, release those shoulders onto the floor, releasing the head. Push those hands all the way up into the sky. Breathing in, breathing out, bring those hands all the way down by the side. Bring that right knee in, bring that left knee in, lift the tailbone up off the floor and release. Lift the tailbone up off the floor and release. Lift the tailbone up off the floor. Let that left leg go out straight. Pull that right knee up towards the right shoulder, spreading those legs away from each other. Pull that right leg over your body. Push the right hand away. Push the right hand away. Push that right shoulder to the ground. Push that right knee to the ground. Breathing in. Breathing out. Lengthen the right hand. Lengthen the right knee, push the right hip after the knee, push the shoulder after the hand. Roll onto that left side. Take hold of this right leg behind you. Push that right foot into that right hand. Let those shoulders come down and back. Push that uh, foot into the hand. Let that leg come behind you. Let the left leg drip forward in order to give yourself a bit of stability. Stretch through that hip flexor. Really push that leg behind. Really push that leg behind. Reach, stretch, and then release. And then roll back onto the back. Bring that knee in towards the shoulder again. Stretch through that hip, stretch through that bum. Turn that leg, hold onto the foot. Just hold the foot. Just pull that leg up across the body if you can. So Emma, we're just doing the glute, just hold onto your knee, pull the knee across. So the, uh, the, other, the rest of you hold onto your foot so that you use the, the shin, the calf, sorry, the shin bone as a lever. Pulling that leg across, feel the stretch through this glute. Release that foot, pull that knee up again, and then let that leg go all the way out straight. Take those arms overhead. Reach and stretch, let the shoulders come up to the ears and then pull those shoulders down towards the waist, pull those arms up into the sky, bring that left knee in, pull that left knee up towards that left shoulder, push that right leg away, stretching the legs away from each other, breathing in, breathing out, pull that left leg all the way over the body, push that left hand away, push that left hand away. Push that left knee down towards the floor. Push that hand away, eyes looking left. Taking that hip after the knee, taking that shoulder after the hand, breathing in, breathing out. Rolling onto that right hand side. Take hold of this left foot in that left hand. Keep the knee low. Let that right foot drift forward. Push that left foot into that left hand, stretching through that left quad. Stretching through that left quad, feel it through that left hip. Pushing that left, um, left foot into the hand, stretching, breathing in, breathing out. Pushing that foot into the hand, extending behind you, breathing in. and then release and then roll back onto your back and pull that knee back up in towards that shoulder 
and turn that leg and take first take hold of that foot in the other hand and draw and glide that leg across the body feel the stretch in that glute breathing in push the knee away pulling the foot towards so i'm kind of using my left arm to rotate that shin breathing in breathing out let go of that foot, pull that knee up in towards the armpit, push the other leg away. And then let go of the left leg, let it go all the way out straight away. Can you take those hands overhead, reach and stretch, let the shoulders come up to the ears, pushing them away, pull those shoulders away from the uh, ears down towards the waist, bring those hands all the way up to the sky, bring them all the way over, slide those fingers under the butt. Push those elbows into the floor and come up onto the back of the head, opening that chest, breathing in. Filling those lungs up with air and spreading those ribs, breathing out. Squeeze those shoulder blades together behind your back. Lift that chest up higher, breathing in. Breathing out. Opening, lifting, and then release that back down onto the floor. Bring those knees back into the chest, lift the tailbone up, bring the nose to the knees and release. Bring the nose to the knees and release. Drawing in the core, shoulder blades on the floor, drop the elbows on the ground. Take those hands out wide towards the floor, keeping neutral spine. Right foot, take that down to the ground and bring it back up. Neutral spine, left foot down to the ground, bring it back up. Right foot down to the ground, bring it back up. Left foot down to the ground, bring it back up. Right foot, so I'm just doing heel touch, keeping neutral spine, getting that core engaged. Left foot. Now do both feet, really draw in that core. Hold those feet just hovering off the floor. Bring them back up. You, you decide how much weight your feet have on the floor. Lower those feet down, keeping neutral spine, shoulders away from the ears. Trying to get the back of the hand, back of the arms to the floor, lift those legs back up. Neutral spine with the ribs, heels to the floor. So all the ribs are on the ground, lifting back up. There's a small lift off the lower back. Take those feet to the floor. Bring those legs back up. Take those feet to the floor and slide those legs out straight. Bring those legs back in, bring those legs back up. Take those feet to the floor, slide those legs out straight, keeping that neutral spine, opening the hips up. Bring those legs back in, bring them back up. Take those feet to the floor, slide them out straight. Bring them back in, bring them back up. Okay, this time they stay out straight. Take those legs down to the floor. Slide them out straight. Bring those hands up to the sky. Bring those hands overhead. Breathing in on the out breath, release and stretch. Bring those hands all the way back and we're gonna roll over onto that left hand, that right hand side. Right arms under the head. Uh, right leg straight, left foot is under that right leg. Okay, roll that left shoulder up to the ear, round to the back. Roll that left shoulder, take the arm to. Roll that left shoulder all the way up. Trace those fingers on the floor. Your, your hand will raise when it goes behind you. I don't want you rocking your body back at the moment. Take that left arm all the way up, big circles. Big circles with that hand all the way around. Stop it in the front and go the other way with those circles all the way around behind, up over the head, down in front, all the way over the back, around behind on the floor. Stop in front, bring that hand up to the sky, over behind you. Bring that hand back to the floor. Bring that hand all the way up into the sky, over behind you. You can let the body tip back a little bit, but don't let that left knee come off the ground. Bring that hand back over in front. Take that hand up in the sky, take it over behind. Take those eyes following it. Hold it there, now push those fingers away. Spread those fingers, keep that knee on the ground. It must stay on the ground. 
Right shoulder on the ground, right knee on the ground, stretching through that forearm. Glide that hand up and down a bit so the back of the hand stays parallel to the floor. Feel the fascia in that four, in that the whole length of that arm stretch. Feel the, the chest stretching, breathing in, breathing out. Bring that hand all the way back into the sky. Bend the elbow, put that in the sky, and then pull that elbow all the way over to the floor behind, pushing the elbow down. Feel the stretch through the front of this shoulder. Eyes are looking at that arm. And then release. Put both arms out in front of you straight. Bring that top arm all the way over. Releasing, getting that hand to the floor. Lift your back by pushing your head into the ground and adjust your shoulders and push those hands away from each other, trying to get, aiming to get both shoulders on the floor. Breathing in. Keeping that left knee on the ground, breathing out and stretching. Release those uh, legs. Come, come, let your knees come up, come onto your back and then roll over onto that left hand side. Put that left leg straight, support the head with the underneath arm. Put the top leg, Top foot under that bottom leg. Roll that shoulder up to the right shoulder up to the ear, top round and back. Roll the right shoulder. Let that arm follow that shoulder. Let that arm come into a big circle with that arm staying straightish. All the way around. All the way around. Keep it with a fairly decent pace in that flow. So you, you can roll. You can let the body roll back a bit, but not too much. I want the right knee to stay on the ground. All the way around with this arm. All the way around. And then stop when it's in front of you and go the other way, down to the leg, over the back, around the top, down the front, over the leg, around the back, over the top, down the front. Move the leg, around the back, this time, hold it still in front of you. Breathing in, take that top arm all the way to the sky and over. Keep that right knee on the floor. Let, let the eyes follow that right hand. Spread those fingers, feel a stretch in, that, in the fascia of the forearm. Feel it in the upper arm, feel it through the chest. Push those fingers away, palm to the sky. Spreading those, hands, spreading those fingers and then glide it. So the back of the hand stays parallel to the floor. Gliding it up and down a little bit. Eyes are looking towards that hand or up to the sky. Let that hand glide. Bring that arm all the way up to the sky, bring it over. Bend the elbow, take the elbow all the way over to the floor. Stretching the chest, releasing the neck. Trying to get the elbow down. Bring that hand back. Bring the un underneath hand straight away from you. So one hand stacked on the other. Top arm all the way over to the ground. Keep that right knee on the floor. Push the back of the head in the ground. Lift so you can turn those shoulders and stretch. Aiming to get both shoulder blades on the ground. Push those hands away from each other. Take those eyes to that right hand. Bring those hands back together. Bring those hands apart, stretch the backs of the shoulders. Breathing in, breathing out. Bring those hands back together. Release the legs and turn over onto your tummy. Turn over onto your tummy. Forearms. Forearms level with the uh, outside edge of the, the long side of the mat, fingertips near the top. Level yourself up. Roll those shoulders up to the ears, down and back. Clench the bum, push the pubic bone in the mat. Draw the tummy button in, lift it up, breathing in. On the out breath, push those forearms into the mat and lift that upper body up, pulling those shoulder blades together, breathing in. Breathing out, release back down. Draw the tummy in, push the pubic bone into the mat, breathing in. On the out breath, push those forearms into the mat, lift that upper body up, keeping the bottom ribs on the floor, tighten the thighs, lift those legs up off the ground. 
Try and slide that body forwards on the mat, pulling those shoulder blades together, breathing in. Release everything down. Roll those shoulders up, the ears down and back. Push those forearms in the mat, clench the bum, lengthen the legs, draw the tummy in, pushing the top of the body forwards as if you're trying to slide forward on the mat. And then release. Roll those shoulders up to the ears, down and back, breathe in. On the out breath, push those hands and forearms into the floor, lifting that upper body up, clenching the bum, legs are off the floor, tummy's engaged, pushing that chest forward, lengthening the head from the feet. Bottom ribs attached to the mat, pubic bone attached to the mat, forearms attached to the mat. Pushing yourself forward, lengthening. Take those arms away, holding yourself here, resting on the bottom ribs and the pubic bone. Pulse those hands to the sky for five, four, three, two. Hold them there for one. Take those hands out wide. Bend those hands back in. Take those hands out wide. Lift those arms up for five, four, three, two, one. Bend those hands back in, lower everything to the ground. Roll those shoulders up to the ears, down and back. Clench the bum, push the pubic bone in the floor, draw the tummy and lift it, lift those legs up. Bring those hands and forearms up into the sky. Lower the elbows down. Lift those hands and forearms up, elbows up too. Touch the elbow down. Lift those arms up. Touch the elbow down. Make sure your tummy's engaged and lifted. Hold those arms up. Lengthen the head from the toes, foreheads on the ground. Pulse those arms up for five, four, three, two. Hold them up for one. Take those arms straight out wide. Bend those arms in. Keep the tummy lifted. Take those arms out wide, pulse the arms up for five, four, three, two, one. Bend those elbows in and rest everything down. Roll those shoulders up to the ears, down and back. Clench the bum, lift those legs, push those forearms into the floor, lift that chest up. Resting on the bottom rib and the pubic bone, draw the tummy in, make sure it's lifted, lengthen the head from the toes, breathing in. Breathing out, pull those shoulder blades together. Take those hands away from the floor. Pulse those arms up for five. Eyes looking at the mat, four, three, two, one. Push those arms straight forward in front of you. Bring those elbows down towards the waist. Legs are up, bums clenched. Push those arms straight up in front. Bring those elbows down to the waist. Push those arms straight up in front. Bring those elbows down to the waist. Push those arms straight up in front. Hold them there. Lift the left arm, right leg for five, four, three, two, one. Lift the right arm, left leg for five, four, three, two, one. Bring both elbows back. Holding here, lift those hands up for five, four, three, two, one. Put the hands down by the bottom ribs, breathing in. On the out breath, push off those hands, come onto those thighs. Lower those elbows, come back to the bottom rib. Legs are pivoting, so legs are lifted. Shoulders back and down, push off those hands, come onto those thighs. Rock forward, back onto those ribs. Push those hands onto the floor, come onto those thighs. Push those arms straight, come onto the knees. Lengthen the head from the toes. Lower the body down onto the thighs. Lift onto the knees. Lower the body onto the thighs. Lift onto the knees, push the bum in the air and go back into child pose. All the way back, stretch that back, stretch those armpits. Reach those arms forward, walk them over to the right hand side of the mat. Push the bum left, stretch through that left shoulder. Walk those hands over to the left side of the mat. Drop the bum right, stretch through that right shoulder. 
Bring those hands back to the middle. Pulling those knees apart, lift that body up onto all fours. Hands are under the shoulders, knees are under the hips. Turn the inside of the elbow forward, middle fingers parallel. Turn the tailbone down, bring the eyes down, bring that back up. Turn that tailbone up, bring the belly down, bring the eyes up. Turn that tailbone down, bring that back up, bring the eyes down, keeping those elbows uh, turning forward. And then turn that tailbone up, bring those eyes up, bring the belly down, breathing in. On the out breath, gliding back, so we just close down that hip. Good, pulling those knees apart, lift yourself back up using your glutes. And then Gliding back, keeping the tension on the knees, pulling apart, tummy to the thighs, breathing in. And the out breath, pull those legs apart, lift yourself up. Ease yourself back, tummy to the thighs. Pull those knees apart, lift yourself back up. Slide those hands forward on the mat, come down into that uh, puppy. Take that chin to the floor, chest as far to the ground as you can. Let those armpits open, breathing in, breathing out, pushing those arms away, pushing those arms down into the ground, breathing in, opening those armpits, breathing out. Release, let those arms slide forward. Just a few millimeters. Let that chest come lower to the floor. Bring yourself back up onto the all fours, bring those hands under the shoulders. Turn that tailbone down, push that back up. Breathing in and on the out breath, turn that tailbone up, bring those eyes up, bring the belly down. Slide those hands forward, taking the chest to the floor, bring the chin to the floor. Try and make those elbows straight, feather the stretch, is pushing the armpit to the ground. Breathing in, breathing out. Push those forearms into the ground. Stretching through those armpits, breathing in, breathing out. Lifting that body up, letting those hands come back under the shoulders. Turn the tailbone down, bring the back up, eyes down. Turn the tailbone up, bring the belly down, bring those eyes up. Breathing in, slide those hands forward one more time. Take the chest down to the floor, push those hands away. Breathing in, breathing out, reaching, chest down, push those arms into the floor. Breathing in, breathing out, release. Bring yourself back up onto all fours. Walk your knees forward and sit yourself down. Sit yourself down, put your legs up straight in front. Roll those shoulders up to the ears, round and back. Roll those shoulders up to the ears, round and back. Grabbing your stick, rest it on your legs. Hold behind those thighs, lift that chest up. Take hold of that stick in the hands. Pull that chest to the sky. Push those knees down, push those toes up towards your nose. Lift the stick up in front of you, breathing in. On the out breath, pull that, chest, that stick towards the chest. Push that stick forward. Pull that stick towards the chest, chest up, Sandra. Push that stick forward and turn the other way and then you'll see me easier. Pull that stick towards the chest. Push that stick forward. Bring that stick straight up in the sky. Pull that stick down behind the head. So wrists and forearms are in a straight line. Try not to cock the wrist backwards like I've done. Try to keep your wrist straight. Push that arm straight up in the sky. Take the stick behind. Straight back, bring the stick up to vertical. Take it straight back behind. Keep it behind and bring it down. Keep those wrists straight. <clears throat> Hold the stick here. 
Take the whole arm backwards, not just the hand. Back, back, back. You might want to hold wider on the stick. Back, back, back. Hold back, hold back, hold back. Pull the hands apart from each other, holding the stick. Push the stick up into the sky. Stay vertical, Ianthi. Pull that stick down. Breathing in. Pulling the hands apart, push that stick up. Keeping the tension between the arms and the shoulders makes it easier. Pull that stick down behind you. Keep it away from your body. Push that stick up. Bring it over in front of you. Lift the chest up. Bring the stick to the chest. Push the stick away. Bring the stick to the chest. Push it up into the sky. Bring it down behind you. Rest it on the shoulders. Lean the body back. Keep that chest open. Point those toes, flex those feet. Point those toes, keep that chest up, turn left. Back to the front, turn right. Back to the front, turn left. Back to the front, turn right. Back to the front, one more each side, turning left. Right. Sit yourself back up, chest high. Push that stick in the sky. Don't give up yet. Bring the stick down in front. Pull the stick to the chest. Lift the chest up. Push that stick in front. Bring that stick back. Push that stick in front. Rest the stick on the floor. Put those hands on the floor behind you. Arms on the ground. Roll those shoulders up to the ears, down and back. Push that chest up. Bring those toes to the nose, tighten the thighs. Breathing in on the out breath, clench the bum, lift those hips and lower. Pull those upper arms back so we lower down. Pull those upper, I bent my elbows, pull those upper arms back towards you, breathing in. Straighten those elbows, breathing out, clench those legs, lifting up. Eyes to the sky, lowering down. Yep, you can keep your knees bent if you want. Lift the chest up, breathing in on the out breath, clench and lift. Holding strong, lowering down. Keep those armpits open. So it's a shoulder, lift up. Bring that left knee in, bring that right knee in so that your knees are bent, your hips will be dropped slightly. Clench the bum, lift those hips high. Make it a hip flexor stretch. Push into those hips. Gliding forward, gliding back. Gliding forward, gliding back. Gliding forward, gliding back. Lower that bum down to the floor. Push those legs out straight. Push off those hands, come vertical. Bring those arms all the way up into the sky. Bring those arms all the way out wide, dust the floor. Put your left hand on your right knee, right hand behind, lift and turn. See much, how much further you can turn than when you started. Other way, right hand on left knee, left hand behind. See how much further you turn this way. Back to the front. Slide those hands forward and stretch that back. Fingers over the toes, pull yourself forward, push those knees down. Release those legs, come up to vertical again, holding those knees, lift that chest up high. Bring those arms all the way up into the sky. Bring those arms all the way out wide, dust the floor. Take those arms all the way up, hold them there, breathing in. On the out breath, push those hands up, push that chest up. Breathing in and on the out breath, release those arms. Rest them on your legs. And roll your shoulders. Good work, girls. Lovely to see you all this morning. Cloudless blue sky out there. It's going to be a lovely day. Here comes summer.